Hey guys, it's me and welcome back to Soma. I think we're getting really close to the end because we're near the rocket launch dome. It showed us how it works. Uh, we just need to find the Ark to put it in there. Uh, so that's what we're going to go do. We're going to go find the Ark and hope that there is no horrible monstrosity uh, waiting for me. Hang on a second. Just got to double check. Where is... It's in the storage. So you go down, right? That was Catherine's body. So there's gotta be something down there because I can't get into anywhere else. I don't think. Is there anything else over here? Do I could get in? That's the service area. That's the dive room. No, I checked that. I can't get into the service area. Can I? Wait a second, I can. Wait, what? Power relay. What? Ooh. Okay, that is nothing. What is this? Oh, it's a bathroom. Oh, heels! I don't think I need it, but I'll take it. What if I stick my other non-hand in there? Will it give me a hand? Anything? Ooh. This is a storage, but it's not the right storage. Oh, yes. Bathe in it. Coat me in it. Top to bottom. Yes. Lovely. Just let me... Yes. Perfect. Okay. Nope. Nothing. I'm waiting for some hideous and horrible monstrosity to come charging at me. But I think I left them all behind. Okay. So it's down here somewhere. Don't mind me while I slowly make my way down. You know, you could probably grip onto the railing on the side there and then just kind of slide down, kind of. Okay. Wait, what's this? How did I miss this before? I thought this was closed, but then again, doors keep opening and closing on me without my knowledge. What is this? Oh. Well, I took a thing. Wait, will this help me open up the doors? Oopsie, I ran a little too fast. Okay, well, I can't do anything to that one. What about this one? Can I add it to this one? I can! Oof. Open, says me! Open the door! I need the Ark. Here it is. We got the Ark back. Good job, Simon. Take it to the assembly space and load the bullet. Okay. Do, 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 do. Is that over here? Yeah, it's over here by the dead body. By Catherine's dead body. Okay. You're not. Okay, you need the power thingy too. Okay, hang on, hang on. I'm coming. Where was it again? Over here. I'm coming through. Good thing I'm a robo and have never ending sprint. Did that door? Okay, it did just stay open. Zoomy zoom. Zoomy zoom zoom. Over here, this way. Gotta remember which path I came from. Uh, a yunk. Yunk. Okay. I'm gonna push a button! Ooh. That's cool. Is that it? I'm really not that familiar with guns of any size. Oh, here we go. All systems say go. Lock and load. Okay, I'm coming! Wait. No, wait. That power thingy would probably need to stay there in order for that to keep going. Okay, I'm coming. Hang on. I'm... I only have one hand. But don't worry, we'll make it. We've... 
waited this long, we can wait a little bit longer for me to climb a ladder. Okay. Now what? Now we just need to get the shell onto the gun and then kaboom. Aren't you forgetting something? Kinda hope it doesn't go I'm kaboom. Get us on board the Ark. Don't we need to make another scan? Oh, don't you worry. You don't operate something like the Omega space gun with your bare hands. You mean it's a pilot seat? Like back at Omicron? Yes, and we can use it to transfer you to the Ark while operating the gun. Two birds and all that. Now, take I don't trust and this. plug it in next to the seat and I'll guide you through the final steps. Then again, I didn't trust you from the beginning, Catherine. There's something about this that's off. There's gonna be some loophole, some twisty turn. Swap in the I'm in the tool. How about now? Ooh, that was a close call. Well, filling an airlock. Yes, submerge. Hey, hell, let's go. Open the door so we can launch this thing. Are you gonna? Okay, there we go. Was I standing too close for comfort? You're a little too shy. Ooh. Yeah, this screams death. Whoa! <gasps> Get out of the. Oh! This is lovely! I love this. This is gorgeous. That's so cool! Hang on, what is all this stuff? Ooh. What's down there? Oh, that was just for that. Okay, never mind. Uh, what if I go up here? Can I go up here? Okay. Oh, can't do anything up here. I'm waiting for a horrible monstrosity to come and stop me. So wait, if I... If I kill the WoW, or Carl and Kevin and Steve and all of them, are they all dead now? Hang on, I'm questioning the bad guys who weren't actually bad, just corrupted. Comfortable? As good as it's gonna get. Okay, I'll activate the seat. Okay! You'll be able to use the machines to load the bullet you assembled. Again, I'm a photographer, not a crane operator. How do you operate this thing? Don't know, I never tried this one. But pilot seats are notoriously easy to use, so it shouldn't be a problem. You guys really need to watch what you say. Whoa. Oh! There's... Okay. Oh, it is! How lovely. Can I? Ooh, that's zooming. Nice! I did it! Kath, I did it. You were right, this is easy, but I still question a great many things. Something's gonna go wrong. Okay, ready when you are. Just hit the button and we're off. But we need to transfer our minds to the Ark. We also need to make sure it launches at all, so I tied them to a single switch. Just push the button and we're off. Um! Something's gonna happen. This. What are it's... you waiting for? Bracing myself. Well, push the button when you're done. Have I ever mentioned that I don't like you? Fine. Launch! Here we go. No turning back. Woo! Don't mess. Put your hands in the air! I want you to know I appreciate it. Yeah, something's gonna go wrong. Time. 20 seconds. What's the matter with the upload? Just give it a second. 
Called it. Something's gonna go terribly wrong. Ten seconds. Am I not gonna Nine, make it? Eight. Seven. Six. You gotta be kidding me. Five. Four. Three. Come on, load. Two. Yes. Yeah, we made it. <laughs> Woo. Woo. Okay, bye. Have fun. Computer copy. No. You don't we actually get I transferred on there. You just stand the on locks. there. Yeah, I saw. Like but back at Omicron. Simon, I can't keep telling you how it works. You won't listen. You know why we're here. You were copied onto the Ark. You just didn't carry over. You lost the coin toss. We both did. Just like Simon at Omicron. Just like the man who died in Toronto a hundred years ago. This is bullshit. We came all this way. We launched the Ark. I know it sucks, but our copies are up there. Catherine and Simon are both safe on the Ark. Be happy for them. Are you crazy? We're gonna die down here with those fuckers living at large on a spaceship. They're not us. They're not us. I'm sorry you feel that way, Simon. I'm proud of what we did. We made sure that something of the hundreds of thousands of years of human history survived, that something lives on. No, 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 no. Fuck this. Fuck! Fuck this! Fuck you! Fuck you, Catherine! You lied! And I believed in you! I trusted you! You said we're getting Everything on the going fucking dark. Ark! We are on the Ark, you idiot! I didn't lie! I can't be responsible for your goddamn ignorance! You fuck! fuck! Critical failure. Yep, I'm gonna be left in the hey. dark! Please don't leave me alone. Catherine? Catherine? Freaking wonderful. <laughs> I have a feeling like, like it was probably supposed to have a more uh, emotional impact and make me really like think and question a lot of things. But my brain also registered it as a game. But thinking about putting any of these aspects into uh, real life. Um, see me, I, I don't understand like biomechanics, like, uh, mechanics really at all in a sense of machines and computers and AIs, but I understand that it's just, it's a, it's a scan, it's a copy. You're not transferring it from one to the other, it's like basically putting your entire computer hard drive and memory and everything onto a chip and then putting it into another computer. Both computers run the exact same and have the exact same memories and the files and everything. It's a similar thing to that, so like I can understand that, so leaving Simon at Omicron didn't really have much of a huge impact on me because it's, it's not an actual living person, it's not a human brain, it's not a human soul, it's a computer copy. Uh, but like killing, uh, killing Alice and uh, Sarah was, those were a little bit harder because they're actually people. They weren't really living, they were sick and injured and corrupted by WoW, like it wasn't really a life, but those are harder decisions than ones like this and for that ending, like, I knew something was coming. But it's just, it's still, it's like, it's a computer copy. 
So like I I get it. I get how it didn't exactly work, but it did work. The more conscious of the AI is just in purgatory forever. Oh, that was good though. Where am I now? Uh, Whoa. My nails are exceptionally white. Did it work? If it did work, I'm gonna have PTSD for the rest of my life. Having to deal with those monstrosities. This is beautiful. Can I be here? I've been stuck in my house for almost two years now. Can I please go somewhere? This is... This is beautiful. This is gorgeous. I might actually go for a walk after this. It's a little windy out today, but it's... It's a sunny day. It's a nice day. This is... Oh, the flowers! They're so pretty! <laughs> this is beautiful. I take it this is now on the Ark? I have a feeling this is on the arc. Calibration survey. Welcome. If you are reading this, you have successfully entered the arc. Okay. So now there's three conscious Simons. One is in Omicron, one is in uh, the Abyss, and one is on the arc. This survey is designed to give the developers a better understanding of your subjective experience and how to improve your well-being. Please continue with the survey. Yeah, why not? How do you describe your physical condition? I feel a visitor, I feel alien, I feel fake. I feel normal. How do you describe your mental condition? I feel disconnected, separate from body, uh, a change in character. I think more of like a change in character. How would you describe your senses? As expected, normal. I feel more sensitive to and aware of my surroundings. I feel blocked, my senses are numb. I'm lacking one or more of my natural senses. Uh, that one. How would you describe the sensation of your new condition? It's pleasant. I don't like it. Something is wrong. Depressing. I can't shake the feeling of it all being fake. You know what? This actually, where I am right now, this is pleasant. This is a whole lot better than where I was. Are you troubled by the fact that you are no longer strictly human? I feel like I lost myself. Yes, I mourn my previous existence. I don't care what form I take as long as I get to carry on. Somewhat, I feel like I lost part of myself, but... How do you perceive your new existence? It's a direct continuation of my previous self, like a new chapter in my life. It's like being born all over again, a complete doer. It's something completely different and has nothing to do with my previous self. That one. Do you think this new existence will be a life worth living? Yes, this is just as much goofy as I It's both less meaning. Maybe we can find a new sense of meaning in this world. No, it's too detached from reality and everything I know. Ah, number three. Would you rather be removed from the project and accept death? Maybe. Because again, it's not real life. This is nothing but a computer simulation. It's like highly advanced VR. Like, And again, it's a game. 
It's a game. This is not real life. I am not actually this person. But, I don't know. Maybe? Your answers have been saved. Thank you for participating. The ARC team. Wonderful! <gasps> I see buildings. I'm coming! Catherine? That's Catherine. pretty. Hey! I can't believe we actually made it. Well, we did. I'm so relieved. You don't sound relieved. It's okay, Simon. Everything's all right now. This is beautiful. I also love space. All the stars. I just like finding constellations. I love watching... Which one is it? Is it Venus? That moves across the sky? is beautiful. Oh, it's Catherine. It's not Ashley or whatever her name was. It's Catherine. Well, that was Soma. Um, I probably come across as one of the more heartless human beings. Uh, with a lot of my decisions and how my brain sort of it's kind of like accepts the whole scan copying versus actually transference but that's just me <laughs> um, but yeah so from the research that I've done this is also made by the same people who made the amnesia games which are also on my list to play because you know got a whole bunch of horror games that I really want to play through because I'm a glutton for punishment you know nightmares and everything but this was absolutely wonderful that made you think it gave me little heart attacks where I had to not record for a couple days time in between just to sort of keep my sanity and it's just it's an amazing concept and very well constructed and put together and I freaking love it. Um, but yeah. So I guess this is it for Soma. Um, again, it's a really interesting concept, but there's a part of me that really hopes that we don't actually have to come to this conclusion for humanity. Or at least I hope I'm dead by the time that comes. <laughs> um, so yeah, thanks for tuning in. I know this has been a bit of a longer series, but there's a lot of story and a lot of detail that goes into it, and I'm just trying not to miss anything. But it is now time to move on to the next game. And again, I thank you all for holding my hand and coming along on this fantastic journey with me and I look forward to the next journey and thank you so much to the developers of this game for creating something amazing. 
I can't really think of any other word to describe it other than amazing. So I will see you all in the next video. And hope you all have a lovely day. Bye, everybody.